Hello and welcome to the course Save Your Time with Excel User Forum. I'm very happy that you find this course relevant for you. Before we start, I would like to give you a few tips on how can you use this course to your maximum benefit. First of all, use two monitors or at least a laptop with a tablet where you can use Udemy app to see the course. Secondly, pay attention that this is a solution-based course, so we have no abstract coding exercises, but we will be studying coding by make exercises on already prepared code. In the case studies, you will practice to reuse, research and apply your understanding of the course. My recommendation is that you always keep in mind your situation and try to use ideas to the course to improve your experience with Office documents. Excel might be different from one version to another. I'm using Microsoft Office Professional 2016 and uh, VBA version 7.1. In general, it should work, however differences in programming object libraries may make things not working properly. We will handle it in the course, but don't worry if something is not working from the first attempt. Please feel free to post and answer questions in the discussion board. This will help you to learn even more. Reserve some time to research and understand the content. Lectures are actually very short, but you certainly will need to pause and understand the content. Let me also spend a few words about this course structure. First of all, this course will be fun and based around one simple business process, which we will gradually improve along the course while developing our knowledge on the user form. After completing short introductionary part, we will study how to manipulate the user form. We'll learn how to bring user form to the user, how to make sure that data fields are populated quick, and how to write information from the user form to the destination. At the end of the first section, you will have a fun exercise where you will be a company employee that needs to improve the business process. Next section of the course will be dedicated to working with images, pictures. You will learn how to set up image control in the user form, how to bring the picture in it, and how to write information to the destination cell. Another case study will follow as well. Another section of the course will be dedicated to automation of creating PowerPoint slides. You will learn how to link Excel to PowerPoint and make things much, much more efficient. In the conclusive chapter of the course, I will give you a few tips on how can you best apply knowledge from the course, as well as give you a few general advices about programming. Wait, this is not all. I'm not promising, but I will try my best to further delight you with a great dessert. I will going to post more lectures with other specific examples on how you can use user form. You would be able to share your ideas as well using GitHub and I will do the rest by selecting the best ones and adding them to the course. I hope you will like the course and I cannot wait to welcome you in the next chapter. We will start to understand why user form is important and how to use it to save your time and let the computer do the job. See you there.